it is demand. Demand is an economic concept that relates to a consumer's desire to purchase goods and services and willingness to pay a specific price for them. An increase in the price of a good or service tends to decrease the quantity demanded. Likewise, a decrease in the price of a good or service will increase the quantity demanded. Demand is a concept that consumers and businesses are very familiar with, because it makes sense and occurs naturally in the course of practically any day. For example, shoppers with an eye on products that they want will buy more when the product's prices are low. When something happens to raise the prices, such as a change of season, shoppers buy fewer or perhaps none at all. Key points that we will see here are The law of demand concerns consumers changing desire to purchase goods and services at given prices. Demand can refer to either market demand for a specific good or aggregate demand for the total of all goods in an economy. Demand and supply determine the actual prices of goods and the volume that changes hands in a market. Businesses study demand to price products to meet demand and generate profits. The demand curve demonstrates visually how the decreasing price for a product increases the quantity purchased. Determinants of demand There are five main factors that drive demand. Product or service price Buyer's income Prices of substitute goods Consumer preferences Consumer expectations for a change in price As these factors change, so can the demand for a product or service. In fact, they change all the time, so demand can be constantly in flux. Now we will talk about the law of demand. The law of demand states that when prices rise, demand will fall. When prices fall, demand will rise. The law of demand is simply an expression of the inverse relationship between price and demand. It involves price only. None of the other drivers of demand mentioned above are involved. If they do come into play, the functioning of the law can be affected. Demand can be seen to change for reasons other than price. Let's see a table here for better understanding. When the price of a certain goods is $10, the quantity demanded is 50. Let's think the price is increased to $20, now the people will buy less, as the price increased. So the demand is 100. When the price again increased to $30, the quantity demanded fall to 50. As the price increases, more consumers stop buying the good. Demand Curve A demand curve is a graph that displays the change in demand resulting from a change in price. It's a visual representation of the law of demand. The demand curve can be a useful tool for businesses because it can show them the prices at which consumers start buying less or more. It can point out prices at which a company can maintain consumer demand and support reasonable profits. On the demand curve graph, the vertical axis denotes the price, while the horizontal axis denotes the quantity demanded. A demand schedule, or table created by a business that lists the quantity of a product that consumers will buy at particular price points, can provide the figures for the demand curve chart. Once plotted, the demand curve slopes downward, from left to right. As prices increase, consumers demand less of a good or service. Market demand versus aggregate demand. The market for each good in an economy faces a different set of circumstances, which vary in type and degree. In macroeconomics, we also look at aggregate demand in an economy. Aggregate demand refers to the total demand by all consumers for all goods and services in an economy across all the markets for individual goods. Since aggregate demand includes all goods in an economy, it is not sensitive to competition or the substitution of goods. Nor is it to changes in consumer preferences between various goods. Demand in individual goods markets can be affected by these factors.